video, we will demonstrate how to properly assemble cold expansion fittings with PEX reinforcing rings produced according to ASTM standard specification F1960 for use with crosslink polyethylene or PEX and polyethylene of raised temperature resistance or PERT tubing systems. This type of fitting system is known as cold expansion because the tubing does not have to be preheated before being expanded. The first step is to have a clean square cut on the end of the tubing using a proper plastic pipe cutter in good working condition. Then the PEX reinforcing ring is slid over the end of the tubing. Some of these rings have an integral stop to prevent the ring from sliding too far. If there is no stop, be sure to position the ring flush with the end of the tubing. The next step will be to expand the tubing and the ring together so the fitting, which is manufactured from lead-free brass or an engineered polymer such as PSU, PPSU, or PPS, can be inserted into the tubing. Both manual and electric tools are available for this operation. We are using an electric tool in this video. Make sure the correct size expander head is installed on the tool. We are using a nominal one half diameter. Insert the expander head into the tubing as far as it will go, being sure that the reinforcing ring remains in position. Then activate the tool. As the tubing is expanded, the conical expander head will slide deeper and deeper into the tubing. In this version of the electric expander tool, the head automatically rotates between expansions to make the tubing fully round inside and eliminate any internal ridges between expander head segments. With a manual tool, be sure to slightly rotate the tool head between expansions to make sure the tubing is fully round and without internal ridges. After the expansion is complete, quickly insert the fitting into the tubing. Depending on the diameter and the temperature of the tubing, the fitting must be inserted within 5 to 30 seconds before the tubing shrinks and its diameter reduces. Cold tubing may shrink more slowly. Insert the fitting fully into the tubing until the end of the tubing hits the stop on the fitting. Be sure that the PEX reinforcing ring has remained in position during this step. If the fitting does not insert easily into the tubing, then quickly remove the fitting and re-expand the tubing, holding it open for a few seconds after the last expansion. If the fitting is an elbow or T and needs to be rotated to align with another pipe, be sure to rotate the fitting quickly before the tubing has tightened on the fitting. Once the connection is completed, wait approximately 30 minutes at room temperature before applying a pressure test. Thanks for watching this video. 